Hi there Libra, thank you for joining me for your weekly forecast for week commencing the 10th of June. Last week's new moon occurred in your sister air sign of Gemini, encouraging you to open up your world, be much more adventurous. The problem at the start of this week through to Wednesday is that Mars, which is also in this more daring part of your scope now, is clashing with the rather draining influence of Neptune. And just as you do try to break the chains of restriction to do your own thing, somebody could put a mighty guilt trip on you about what they feel you should be doing for them. Or it could be that you are stuck with some kind of obligation or responsibility which you can't just let go of. This may be a poorly relative. It could be that you yourself are not 100% well. And your limitations can really seem to frustrate you at the very start of this week but it's something you need to try to avoid getting too down about. Because Venus, your ruler, is combining with Mercury at the very top of your horoscope, and one of your greatest gifts is the ability to cultivate contacts and to work diplomatically with other people and create a fantastic impression in the process. And as these two get tighter together towards the end of this week, you can use these skills to great effect. But equally, the Sun is going to be combining with Jupiter, and this can give you a stroke of fortune. This fortune may be hard to exactly predict. It could be that someone's going to give you some knowledge or information which you can use to improve your situation. It's possible that an application for a higher education institution will prove successful, or you'll head off on that backpacking tour that you've always dreamt of, or that holiday to an exotic and remote place. But equally, it could just be about your frame of mind, about having more courage to break out from whatever tethers you to that sense that you can't do it that something stops you or that circumstances stop you. Try to think of all the reasons why you can do things, not the reasons why you can't. Even at the very end of this week, the quarter moon is going to be casting more potential doubts into you. If you let them in, they will overwhelm you. So you need to stay resolutely positive and determined to make some changes to your life, to make it more spontaneous and much more go-getting. It's been a real pleasure being with you. Thank you for joining me. Good luck and goodbye for now.